storm alert center we go and uh, for the first time in a while no storms in our immediate area that's a good thing yeah beautiful thing look at that food city camera guys uh, just an absolutely gorgeous day mm -hmm. to be outside and alive in the tennessee valley we love it and good news is we're going to keep that going for the next few days right through the rest of the week i am putting in a slight chance of an isolated sprinkle late tomorrow night after you're already in and settled down i'm talking about after 9 30 10 o'clock but even then it's just a sprinkle if even that overall awesome weather on wednesday awesome thursday and friday and then we'll have some clouds building in on saturday with some showers and storms likely on Sunday. I say likely, let's say possible on Sunday into Monday. So right now we're at 84 degrees in Chattanooga, not even getting out of the 70s on the plateau or in the Blue Ridge. Uh, 83 degrees in Dalton. So grilling on the deck, I would recommend you do that. 84 right now, we'll get down to 82 by 7, 79 degrees by 8 p.m. And look at that, plenty of clear skies as we head into our evening hours. Not only that, very comfortable air. Notice dew points in the 50s. That is very comfortable indeed. But over the weekend, we'll start to see that humidity rising that will coincide with rain chances being reintroduced into the Tennessee Valley as well. Uh, not for tonight, though. Go out and enjoy the heck out of it. A lot of severe storms down in Louisiana, back into eastern Texas. Not a fun place to be today. Uh, moving into Wednesday, this is where we're talking about maybe a sprinkle or two late Wednesday night. Beautiful pretty much all day long. We'll have a couple of clouds in the afternoon. You can see the storms off to the west. As we move through our Wednesday night, uh, we'll see maybe a few as this dies down and dives southward, a few sprinkles moving through Chattanooga. But again, uh, well after you're settled in, we're talking 9 30, 10, maybe 10 30 at night tomorrow. Moving into Thursday, Friday, looking good. Mostly sunny skies and just as nice as you would want it to be. Next storm system off to the west. That low pressure is going to work its way eastward slowly. But for Saturday, I'm still going to leave the rain chances low. We're talking 10% chance of maybe a sprinkle or two out in advance of this main line. Now, I say this main line, you can see a couple of sections. Here's one, here's the other one. Uh, as this moves through, we're going to see a lot of this energy diving south, but on the northern end of this, it does look like uh, late in the day on Sunday, we'll get some scattered showers and maybe a rumble of thunder that could even linger into the first part of next week. So tonight, mostly clear, just an awesome night. Get the family, go outside, enjoy it. Uh, 61 tomorrow morning in Chattanooga, 57 Cleveland, 54 in Blue Ridge. It's going to feel really nice tomorrow morning and all day. 84 the high, uh, a little breezy in the afternoon, and then we've got that chance for a sprinkle or two late tomorrow night. But all day will be absolutely fantastic. Just be aware. 10 to 15 mile per, per hour breeze out of the northwest is possible, if not likely. Storm alert 7 day forecast. We've got very pleasant weather. I put the rain chance at 10% for Thursday. South of our area, we're going to have some uh, sprinkles on Thursday. I'm putting that 10% chance in just in case one or two bubble up into parts of North Georgia. Don't think it's going to happen, but I'll put it in there at 10% just so you're aware. Uh, looking great for Friday and Saturday, even though we'll have the clouds building in on Saturday. And this is really Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, when we'll start to have better chances for scattered showers and thunderstorms. And that's also when that humidity is going to come back into play as well. Guys.